Hi all my beautiful friends, today's video I am so excited to share with you a couple of winter pieces I got from Boohoo. If you are new here, my name is Charlie and I would really love you to stick around and subscribe to kind of describe my channel. It's just like I've said in past videos, it's more of a lifestyle channel um, and not the lifestyle channels that you're used to. I feel like lifestyle can mean pretty much anything that is part of your life. I know that's not technically what it means. My channel doesn't necessarily have a niche. Um, I kind of just do whatever I'm feeling, whether that's home decor, mostly fashion related and makeup, um, fall routines, animal videos, whatever um, I decide to film is what my channel is going to be. And if you like that or that sounds interesting, I would absolutely love you to stick around and subscribe. So today I'm doing a winter boohoo haul. Um, they were having obviously their 60% sale. They always are having 60% off sales. And then I was able to find a coupon and if I can, I will link it below for an additional $15 off. So it really made me save uh, around $250. When, um, these pieces have lasted me from the past. Um, I still am wearing clothes from two, three years ago from them. I feel like they're very comparable to like Forever 21, Walmart, stuff like that. Um, they just have more current um clothing options i guess um sometimes it's hard for us bigger girls to find something that doesn't kind of look um mature i should say um so i just wanted to share this it's getting too cold to wear fall um clothes so i needed a couple more warmer options and i really love what i got so if you're interested in seeing it stick around oh i'm going to show you no 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 we're not going to growl no no you're gonna you're gonna be a nice boy no no, it's leaves, it's the woods, no. So if you're interested, definitely stick around. I'm gonna show you each piece and then I'm gonna try it on for you in the end. Um, before I would just try everything on and talk about it while I had it on, but I've watched a couple of try on videos with hauls and most of the time they haul them and then right at the end, they'll show you the pieces. Um, if you like it this way, definitely let me know or if you like it better the other way where I put everything on and talk about it as I do it. Either way, I'm fine with. If you don't care, then I'll just continue to do it maybe both ways. So um, let's get started. Come on, you have to move, please. Come on, sit right here. Come on, watch out, watch out, watch out, sit. So I took a chance and bought, I'm actually wearing a pair. I took a chance and bought leggings. Um, they were really inexpensive. They were $8. They were really inexpensive. They were like eight bucks. I got a size... Um, Hold on, it's gotta tell me in here. Now, remember when you're shopping on Boohoo, I should tell this, this is a little disclaimer, they are UK sizes. So there'll be a part where you can literally put your height, your weight, your age, and what your body type is, and they'll kind of suggest sizes for you. They will convert over to US sizes. So just remember we're different than the UK sizes. So in the UK, these are 18, but I got a 14 in the US and Canada are both 14. Um, I took a chance. They are really nice quality. As you can see, I got two pairs of them. They are a little see-through, but most of these leggings are. Plus, they were only $8. They have that really soft material, kind of like Forever 21 or Old Navy. Um, but they're a little big on me, which was surprising. I felt like a 14 would be kind of comparable to like an extra large. I will show you at the, um, at the end of the video what they look like. Um, I definitely like them. I just would go down to like a 12 next time but they're high-waisted, which I really, really appreciated. Um, the, crotch, the crotch of it kind of looked a little low for me, so I wasn't sure how they were gonna fit, but I forgot that they are kind of like high-waisted. They're not tight at all. They're not like tummy control or anything, but if you're looking for something to wear on the weekends, I really liked these, and for eight bucks, you really can't beat that. So so I'm not gonna try on the turtleneck just because it, I don't wanna mess it up and I already have makeup on. I have an entire video on how I style my turtleneck so I will link that down below for you just to see what I look like in a turtleneck. But I loved this color. It's like a really true chocolatey brown and I think this will look beautiful um, for the holidays coming up. I believe I only paid $12. I'll link all the th everything I bought and the prices down below. I ended up going down a size because I was buying all of my dresses in an 18 to be safe and they were definitely too big. I Not where I couldn't wear them, but they didn't fit me like I like. So I dropped down to a 16 and most of the stuff at Boohoo. It looks like here I got an, I did get an 18 just so it fit a little bit um, looser, but I thought this chocolate would look really pretty under all of my clothes. Now I have one gray one, three black ones, and this chocolate one, and I just wanna grab a red one. So the next time I'm at Walmart, I might grab them. 
if you are looking for it and you are on a real, real budget, Walmart has them for $7. They had gray, black, red, one other color, but I don't remember. If you're really, really on a budget, maybe check Walmart first. But this is nice quality. I've worn um, my two black ones. I wear them literally almost every day interchangeably. I'll wear them for two days, wash them. And they've been washed quite a few times and they're still holding up pretty well. Um, obviously with wear, with turtlenecks, the necks get weird, but I'm really impressed with them. Okay, it's kind of hard to pick from the pile, but I'll just grab and go. This I got in a size 16. It is this gorgeous cranberry peplum top. I needed something for Friendsgiving next weekend and I thought this would be perfect. Um, and I love this color. I feel like it is so festive and I was thinking of wearing like a black pencil skirt with it for the Friendsgiving. Um, I wasn't sure what I was gonna wear. I didn't know if this package would be on time. So I had picked up, so I picked out a couple other things, but I love this, sorry, the lighting's, it's really bright out today. Um, so I thought this was gorgeous. I will definitely try this on for you so you can get a better idea, but it's just like a peplum top and it hits me right at the waist. So it's just this beautiful, like ribbed cranberry. I say it's a peplum top. I'm not sure if it's actually is, or just like a baby doll top, but I loved it and I think it's gonna look great on. Again, I got that in a size 16. I did try that one on when it first came and it fit really nice. And I, like I said, it's gonna look really cute with like a pencil skirt, a black pencil skirt. I at least hope it is. Okay, so the next thing I have is kind of surprising for me because I kind of always shied away from corduroy. I don't know, I have never, ever, ever liked it. And I feel like recently everybody's kind of wearing corduroy and I really like the style of it. So I was able to pick up two tops, but this one I was obsessed with. And again, I'm gonna show you better um, when I do the try on. I did get this in a 16 and it fits really nice. I was nervous when I saw it at first, but um, it's really nice. So it's this corduroy, like a sage green maybe. Um, how the heck are we gonna, uh, like a seafoam green here and then like more of a mossy green. And then um, the same over here only with a cream color. It's collared, it fits so nice. The bottom of it is just a straight across. There's no like distress or anything. I feel like this is gonna look amazing. Um, and it's a real pocket here, buttoned down. Now what I was thinking about doing with this is wearing this over like a turtleneck open with high-waisted pants or sweatpants or something. Um, definitely you could wear it um, regular. I'll show you how I would, um, I'm gonna show you it buttoned up normal, but I loved this block, but I loved this block color. I love the block colors. I love the mixed colors and I love the color green. I think green is so flattering and people kind of don't, you know, I feel like people shy away from it, but I love it. And I feel like this is perfect. I loved the cream and the greens and like, I guess that's kind of translating gray, but it's more of like a mossy green. I don't know why it's picking up so gray, but yeah, I'm excited to try this on for you. And again, I got that in a 16 and it really wasn't expensive. I think it was like right around 20 bucks, 16 bucks. So I was excited for that. Um, I'll just go right on to the next corduroy piece. This, I was so excited. First of all, it's a color, it's a size 16. I don't even know what color this would be. I wonder if it tells you, burgundy. They're saying it's burgundy, but I don't find this to be burgundy. It looks more like a terracotta maybe. Um, I feel like burgundy is more purple. To me, this is more like terracotta, but maybe I'm wrong. It does have two functional pockets and it's long sleeve corduroy, it's like hard to show, um, but I love the distress on the bottom. I think this is gonna look so cool, open with a pair of jeans and a turtleneck, or just worn oversized with leggings. Um, it kind of looks like you stole your boyfriend or your husband's shirt and just wanted to wear it for the day. Um, I definitely love it. I think the color is so unique and so perfect for the holidays, so I'm excited to try that one on for you as well. Okay. So I don't usually pick up blues, um, but this one caught my eye, this royal blue. I just literally couldn't pass it up. I loved it so much. And I got this one, I think a size up. I did get this one in 18 because I want it to be oversized. And I think this sweater is gonna look fantastic for these upcoming holidays. A lot of people have multiple holidays to go to. You have Christmas, New Year's, 
Um, I know people have in-laws and friends and I just picked up a couple pieces because I knew we were going to be doing a lot of things and I thought this was gorgeous. It reminds me here, I'll show you kind of over, it kind of reminds me of like your mom's sweater from the 80s. I know it's like hard to show on camera, but I obviously you'll be able to see it better when I try it on. I loved the neck. I thought that was really, really cute. Again, you could wear this over a turtleneck. You could wear this on its own. I loved it. And it wasn't like that material that was too, too heavy where it was going to keep you like stifling hot. And I thought this color was stunning. And like I said, I don't always pick these colors. So I was like really impressed with it. And it's a decent length. So I think you could definitely um, get away with it with leggings or even a, you know, a nice pair of jeans or um, you could even wear slacks with it. I thought this was really cute and I loved this neckline and the color was incredible. And like I said, it's not too, too hot. So you definitely could layer that and not be like dying. So I have two more pieces and then I'll try everything on for you. Um, I don't usually buy cardigans. They're not like my favorite, um, excuse me. They're not my favorite clothing piece. My grandmother usually gives me her, car like she'll give me a cardigan once she's done wearing it. And then I kind of feel obligated to take it, but I just feel like they kind of make me look a little too, um, I just don't love them. I guess maybe it's a style of cardigans because they're, she's 75 and you know, I don't want to not take them and then I can have them forever. But um, I saw this cardigan and I just couldn't pass up on it. I'm going to stand up and show you it. It's so gorgeous. It's like perfect for Christmas. It kind of reminded me of like a 1950s, like um, those 1950s sweaters that the boys would give the girls, if you know what I mean. Um, very like greaser and 50s, like a sports sweater. And I feel like the green and red and uh, cream will look really nice this holiday. I love the patch on the elbow and I love the bottom. I think this is going to be really fun for the holiday and I love it and it will kind of wear well throughout the year. You definitely could wear this any time of the year, but I just thought this would look really, really cool. And I got this in a 16. I definitely should have went down one size in that because um, either it's running true to size or a little bit bigger, but for an oversized sweater, you can't go wrong. Okay, you guys, so this last piece, um, no judgment. I know this might not be everybody's favorite um, thing or top or jacket, whatever it is. Um, I know this might not be for everyone, um, but I have been looking for, this is not exactly what I've been looking for, but it's similar enough. Those 1990s, like three quarter zip ups, they were kind of cropped, but not really. Um, they are very hard to find and the few that I have found were too expensive to not be exactly what I was looking for. Now, if it was, you know, exactly what I wanted, I would have splurged and bought it, but they never are. So I always kind of pass on them. Um, I found a couple, I found a few of Dick's that were so close, but they just weren't for me. So I found this, I loved it. It came in denim and it came in black. I almost regret, I do regret not getting it in black as well. But again, this is not going to be everybody's uh, cup of tea. Now, the only thing about this, let me show it first. Let me stand up and kind of show you. Again, I'm going to do a try on. Um, it does look very big. I did buy it oversized. It does cinch at the bottom. So that's a really actual working tie. Um, I ended up getting this in a size 18, I guess, to be safe. I definitely could have used a... Um, 16. I, for anyone who is wondering, in my jeans, I am a size 16. Um, I can do 18 like a tour it just depends. So 16, 18. My leggings, I'm much smaller on the bottom than I am on my top. My top is much larger. So leggings, I do an extra large almost always. And then for tops, I am anywhere between a 1 and a 2X. Um, it just depends on the fit and what I want it to look like. Um, so that's just general, like my size, I'm 5'4", um, and my bust is like a 40, I think a 40. So just for anyone who is looking to buy anything. Um, and this has a fleeced lined hood. Believe this or not, this is very heavy. Now the black, I'll put, I'll put a picture up of what the black looked like. The black was very, very cool and I should have got it. I love here it is a three-quarter sleeve now the only thing i'm like pissed off if i wish i'd known is this is not a functional pocket 
that's all. That's like the only kind of downside. It's not a functional pocket. It's got really nice, thick, big sleeves. I know this isn't going to be everyone, but I think this is going to look so friggin' cool um, this winter. It's nice and heavy, but you got to also remember, I am like a huge sucker for jean jackets. Um, I probably have six or seven. I have a whole video I'll link down below of like all of my jackets, but most of them are jean jackets. Um, this does pull, so you can definitely um, leave this nice and wide or tighten it, whatever you want to do. But I think this is going to look so cool over leggings with like high socks and maybe like a turtleneck or um, I guess you couldn't put anything over it. I don't know why you'd want to. I know this again isn't for everybody. I'll have to look on the website how they styled it um, and maybe try to like mimic what they did but again i really love it it's nice and heavy i think i paid like 30 or 36 dollars for it and it was definitely worth it it's going to be super duper warm when i have outdoor activities to do um especially with the high school my daughter's in jrotc so they do a lot of outdoor activities fundraisers so i'm excited to wear this so that is all of the things that i got in the haul i'm going to get to the try on portion and then we will sit down and talk about everything um i'm really impressed with all the clothing the only thing i have to say is when this i just want to be completely transparent and honest this is the first time it's ever happened with this and one i think this and the blue sweater i can't really remember maybe it was the corduroy there was a there was a slight odor to it um i don't know how to describe the odor i no longer smell it i kind of let them sit for i got this package today is thursday i got my package three days ago so the scent is completely gone so i don't know if maybe that was like a fluke thing or it was the plastic they were in but I kind of want to be transparent. So I will be right back with all the try on portion. Um, I'm not going to style these. Um, I can also do that in another video, just show you how I style them like outfits of the day. But for right now, I'm just going to show you how everything fits. So if you're interested in seeing that, definitely keep on watching guys. Hey, you guys, so this is the fit of the legging. Um, now that I'm kind of look at them, they really don't fit terrible. Um, they do like at the very, very bottom, there's a little scrunch to them. Um, but if you're going to wear them like with boots or anything, you'll never even notice. As you can see, they come up. Here is, here, let me lift you just a little bit. As you can see, here is my, <clears throat> here is my bust. So they come up very, very, very high. Like this is where my boobs are. So they are extremely high waisted, um, which I personally love. I know some people it's not their favorite, but they really don't fit as bad and as terrible as I thought. And they're so soft like they're so comfortable so like if you are okay so with the leggings i definitely would recommend maybe going down one regular size so if you're usually a 16 maybe a 14 that's definitely up to you you definitely can get your regular size and just see um but for me again like i've said i have like no behind no, i don't have really big hips or anything so I am much smaller <clears throat> on my bottom. Most of my weight is up in my chest and my stomach area. And <laughs> I really wasn't blessed with anything down below. So, okay, you guys, so here is the fit of that really beautiful, like royal blue sweater. Um, you can definitely open it a little more and give yourself a little more cleavage. Um, you can close it a little bit. This isn't like Velcro, but if you were like a little, um, possibly like wanted a little more modest, you could definitely put a little like, maybe just stitch right there. Um, I could have my grandmother very easily stitch there. You could put a little bit of like um, hem tape or like fashion tape if you were uncomfortable with the extra cleavage. It is very like chesty. So you're definitely um, keep that in mind. And But I bought it with the intention of wearing like a turtleneck, a black turtleneck under it, but I actually kind of really like the look of this. I feel like it's very flattering and pretty. Now this is the sleeve. I love the sleeve. Um, they are not tight by any means. It's a very loose fitting oversized sweater. And then it hits me um, at the top of my thigh. And I believe, yes, it covers enough that I could definitely get away with wearing it with leggings i feel like this fits so nicely and i'm very very impressed with it i just feel like this collar is so unique and it kind of just gives you a very like i don't know it's very cool i love it i love this color i'm pretty sure they had it in different colors you could pull the sweater up if you wanted to um 
but I really, really like it. I'm glad I um, got the size I did in it. And I just really like this color. So I might venture more into this type of blue that I don't really have a lot in my wardrobe because I really think it looks nice. So let me step back and show you. So I thought this was really, really nice. Definitely let me know what you think. And if you're thinking about maybe getting this, I really, really love it. Definitely oversized, beautiful, really recommend this one. So I will move on to the next one. Okay, so this is that so this is that cranberry top. It is so gorgeous. Um, and it's so comfortable and it's like not really heavy. So you're good if you're like somebody who um gets hot easily, I think you would be really comfortable in this. And like I said, I feel like it's either like a peplum top or like a baby doll top. The color is so flattering. I think that this cranberry is so perfect for the um holidays. I think it's gorgeous and I love the ribbed look. I think that looks great. And I just feel like if you have a tummy or like with the holidays coming up, if you want to hide and be able to eat a little more, um, these tops are really flattering. And I think, let me know what you think, a little black pencil skirt would look really, really cute with it. But even with the leggings, it looks super cute. I think it, I think it would look cute with these leggings. I think it would look cute with a pair of jeans. This is something you could obviously dress up or down. I just think with the um, pencil skirt, it's gonna look really nice for the holiday. And I just love where it hits. This is generally like what type of a dress that I wear. Um, I feel like it gives me a little bit of a waist, a little more of a shape, um, and I really, really love it. So I'm just gonna throw this sweater on with it because um, like I said, I'm not gonna try on the brown turtleneck because it's kind of obvious what a turtleneck looks like um but i'm just gonna throw this on i wouldn't wear this together i don't think it's gonna look nice i just wanted to show you what this sweater looks like on i really love it and i think it's gonna look so cute for the holidays and very very festive i feel like it's unisex in a lot of ways like um it almost like i said looks like you stole your boyfriend's clothes very 1950s like I said, it's oversized. It's quite big. I should have went down just like maybe one size, but I don't mind it being this big. It's very comfortable. And what I liked about this cardigan is it's not too heavy. Um, you could use it for layering. So you definitely would want to use this as a layering piece because it's not that heavy. So it's going to keep you warm enough, obviously, but it's not going to make you want to die if you decided to layer it with other things. So I really feel like the color is really great for this holiday season and I love this. I love the patchwork. I feel like it's so 1950s. I don't know why I'm getting that vibe from it. Let me know what you think. Um, I know this might not be for everyone, but I do love this top. I think, it, or this sweater, sorry. Um, it's definitely a lot of fun. Um, and I prefer this type of cardigan over like your traditional like teacher, school teacher cardigan, if you know what I'm talking about. Um, this one's a little more of like, it's like a mix between a duster and a cardigan. So yeah, let me take this off and just show you. This top is so flattering. I feel like it slims my body. It feels like it gives me a waist. I feel like I look thinner in it. Um, because sometimes with these tops, they can make you look... A little heavier but I feel like with it being cinched right here at the waist it gives you more shape and less of a boxy look so on to the next one this top I am so impressed with and obsessed with it as you can see now the colors um this is definitely more like a seafoam green and I guess this is like a gray um in person it kind of looks like a mossy green but it's definitely translating gray I love this I think this is gonna look fantastic so let me step back and show you the whole thing um this is again something you you could wear with leggings um you could wear it tucked in into a pair of jeans you could tie it if you wanted to at the bottom just give it a little tie um you could wear it open with uh like a turtleneck underneath this is so flattering i feel like the colors are flattering i feel like the cut of the shirt is flattering i sometimes when you wear these like oversized men's shirts they can kind of make you look a little more heavy, but I feel like they're translating like really nice on camera. And I kind of hope that's what it looks like in real life. I can't imagine it doesn't. Um, I have a lot of room and again, it's not too heavy. It is a perfect layering piece and I'm so impressed, but these colors are like really unique and I love them a lot. And this is a functioning pocket. I like the fit of it. I like the where it hits. So I love the length of it too. Um, this is the whole thing. I think this looks really nice 
something that you could definitely keep casual if you wanted to kind of dress it up a little bit like a like a brunch or something you definitely could wear it i love this i don't know why i didn't give corduroy a chance and i was so rude to corduroy but i am sorry because this looks great and i just it's the color i think it's the color that's really like making me love this so definitely let me know what you think and i definitely want to pair this with other things i don't think brown would go i'm not sure what color do you think would go with this would black look okay with this i'm not sure because it's such a unique color i might just wear it the way it's supposed to be worn like this but i think my husband's gonna love this and i definitely love it so on to the next shirt i hope you guys love this as much as i did so yeah i'll be right back with the next one okay so this is the one that they say is burgundy to me it's more like a terracotta um, like a pinky terracotta but it is again so beautiful now this one is definitely a heavier material um if you are someone who's easily warm you probably wouldn't wear this once you layer this because it's much much heavier um i think this fit is so nice i didn't button it the whole way because it's like it's impossible to get like it's just gonna take too long to button and unbutton again functional pockets i love the color and i hope you can see the trim like the like how it's just like a cut trim like it looks like someone kind of just snipped the bottom off um i hope you're able to see that let me pull you down and see if you can kind of see it better so you can see it kind of looks like someone kind of just decided to cut the bottom of their shirt off um i really am digging so i have to say i'm really kind of digging like this men's look for women even though, like I've said a hundred times, I think it's so ridiculous men's, women's clothes. It's whoever wants to wear whatever they want. But I'm going to assume this is more like a relaxed, like I threw on a husband's shirt and I kind of look sexy and cool and hot in it. And I just love it. And I think it's very current and I love this color. And I think this is going to look super duper cute all winter long. Again, you could kind of tie it up if you wanted to, but I would definitely wear it like more relaxed and baggy. They look great with these leggings. They cover my behind so i could definitely get away with get away with leggings i think these would look cute with a pair of denim jeans uh, anything you wanted i think this is a great top again you could wear this open as like a um like over top this might actually look good with with this chocolate oh yes this would look really nice with this chocolate brown and leave this like open over it and throw on a pair of like um sweatpants and maybe a pair of like high uh like high white socks and a pair of sneakers super duper cute so this is definitely a winner i really got lucky this haul everything is really really nice and has fit really well but this is like again it just looks flattering i feel like i don't look heavy sometimes because i am kind of very top heavy um whenever i wear baggy or clothes like this i feel like sometimes <clears throat> I feel like sometimes I look heavier than I really am, um, but this is really, really flattering and I think the color is beautiful. And I definitely think any, all these pieces that I've picked, I feel like it can be work for any age. Like uh, to me, it's so ridiculous. If you wanna wear it, definitely wear it whatever age you are. Um, it's so silly to me, but like, I feel like anybody could wear these pieces. They're very universal and I feel like they are never gonna go out of style. It's something that you can keep in your wardrobe and just keep recycling and wearing. Um, I'm somebody that just, I wear the same thing over and over again. I don't ever like care if someone see me and I'm not crazy like that. Well, I shouldn't say that because some people I know it bothers them. So I apologize, I don't mean crazy, but I feel like these are very universal and will be great to add to my wardrobe. So I have one more thing, my jacket, and then we will wrap up this video, you guys. Okay, so last but certainly not least, I wanted to show you this amazing jacket on. So I don't have a top underneath, so I can't really like unzip this the whole way, but as you can see, it definitely unzips. You can wear it in any height that you would like. Um, I would probably wear it all the way up. I love how heavy this um, fleece line hood is. I think it looks really nice and would look really super cute for the winter and it's going to keep you warm it is definitely warm it is um the only kind of down the sleeves are not super duper tight i don't mind that some people might so i just want to let you know on me they aren't very very tight um this again there's just no functioning pocket but i think it's still cute so here it is open and just like um 
kind of like casual and then I'm going to kind of tighten it and show you what it would look like tightened and tied so you can see which you know if you would like it either way so that's kind of what it would look like a little more singed I'm sure I could get a little bit tighter if I wanted to um, I don't know what you would wear under this maybe like just a long sleeve shirt um, but I thought this was so cute and I feel like um, I'm not I feel like I'm okay with the fact that I got it a little bit bigger. Um, at first I wasn't sure if I got it too big, but I guess with this like little bit of cinching at the bottom, it doesn't make it too bad. But I think this is really, really cute. And I think people are gonna love this. I love that you can kind of wear it open or pulled all the way up. It's, I wouldn't say it's a shirt. It's definitely a jacket. It's heavy. It's gonna keep you warm. Um, I don't know if you could wear it like in the snow. It's not gonna keep you warm like that, but like if you were layering it and it was like maybe a I don't know 40 degree day you would be perfectly fine in it and here's the hood I think this is so cute I really do I think this is great so let me back up and show you so I really 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 love this let me know what you think um I wish I had gotten it in black as well but I am a sucker for denim and this is the darkest denim I've ever bought so I'm kind of happy to just have it in my wardrobe so we will sit down let me change back into my regular clothes and we will talk about everything and wrap up the video okay my sweet beautiful friends that is the end of today's video I hope you found this helpful if you did definitely subscribe so you don't miss out um, I would love to have you stick around I love interacting with you so definitely remember to leave me a comment um, I would love to know what your favorite piece was um, I feel like the cranberry peplum top is one of my favorite and the green one, although it was very hard. This was definitely my favorite boohoo haul that I've gotten, even over my dresses, everything. I feel like this is definitely up there with one of my favorites. Uh, this is definitely up there with one of my favorite hauls. What I love is, an, what I love most in outfits is something that you can use to dress up or down. It's very versatile, casual, but also could be dressed up. Those are my favorite types of clothing um, and it makes your wardrobe kind of expand and you have more ideas with your clothing. I know some people have a hard time dressing. I did for years. For years I lived in just t-shirts and baggy clothes. I hid my body and it took me a very long time to be okay with wearing things that were a little more fitting. Um, and I still have days where it's hard for me to. I have a lot of extra skin and sometimes it makes me look a little bit heavier than I am but it's there, there's nothing I can do, so I'm gonna wear things that make me happy. If a piece of clothing makes me happy, I wanna wear it. Um, it's not for everybody. I know it takes people years to build confidence, and I have, it took me a long time to really get to where I am. Um, I can give you any advice if you need um, anybody to talk to, I am always here. Just leave a comment down below, and I would love to interact with you. So I really, like I said, hope this was helpful. I will link everything down below for you. I really hope you enjoyed this. I really, really hope you all enjoyed this. Now I gotta get off here, take a couple pictures for you guys. I will link my Instagram down below, my TikTok. I really hope you all enjoy this. I would love to have you stay back. I would love to have you stick around and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.